review of the FTP O Matic and its benefits and its features and how this can save you an enormous amount of time in maintaining and updating your websites. First function here is you can upload files, folders, uh, as many as you want to one server or you can the whole point is to go to multiple servers. Now the file that kind of makes this thing run is a use a basic CSV file. I'll give you an example here. Here's the basic CSV file that the FTP Omatic needs to run. It needs to know the domain name, the user's names, and the passwords. Just simply browse where that is, pre-process it. It's going to list all these uh, domains. Here I got 10 in this example. Now when you upload these, you're going to want to upload them to a specific directory. Uh, in this particular case, I'm using a cPanel, so these are going to be public-html. Uh, let's say if you uh, wanted to upload a uh, link script, and you just wanted that, well then you would change that upload directory. Uh, we're up here, you just put that script. And down here you put public-html slash partners or whatever name you wanted to have it'll create that folder and uh, upload it to each one of the uh, domains for you. The FTP report file is simply a report if there's any files that fail to upload uh, it, it is registered in this so you can follow up and make sure that everything was taken care of properly. Now this has a function where you can just upload these files directly without any substitution. Let's say if you just wanted to upload a, uh, a uh, a array of uh, Web 2.0 uh, tags, icons uh, to all your sites. You could uh, simply upload that single file and there wouldn't be any substitution. The powerful part of the FTP Omatic it allows you to substitute tags in the files and then upload those files after the substitution. In order to do that, it needs a uh, an empty folder, a directory that it can work with. You simply browse and select that. But to show you how powerful it is here, uh, here's a CSV file where I got the domains, username, password, but then I got a tag and a template that says title. So each one of these have a different title put in. Each one has a different description. Each one has a different set of keywords. Each one has a different site title. And there's some content that's different for every one of them and some links. You simply uh, put your template here, tell it to substitute those tags, point it to that CSV file, and it's going to substitute all those, make a copy on your PC, and then upload those to all of your domains. Second tab on the FTP Omatic is a uh, let's say you have five sites, ten sites, 50 sites that you've completely rebuilt on your uh, personal computer, and you want those all uploaded. Well, what I do here is you get that's called a modified template directory where we just simply put each of those domains in a folder that is the same as that domain's name. So here we've got cbfeeds.com and all those folders are inside this what we call the, the modified template directory. You select your CSV file, which would be just your basic one. It's just going to give you the domain, the username, and the password so it can log in to each of these domains and your upload path. Uh, like I said, these are cPanel, so it's going to be public HTML report file where I want to have that located so I can check that over. And I just quickly click start process. I have uh, gone and uh, rebuilt, say, 50 websites. Before I went to bed, I simply started the task, got up in the morning, and all when I got up in the morning, all 50 of those websites have been completely updated, uploaded to the server for me. Very, very quick time-saving tool. The third function is here is protects everyone who really doesn't have a good copy of their current websites on their local PC. That's very important to have a backup. What this does allows you to download and make mere copies of all of your websites. You simply uh, select an empty folder for them all to be uh, downloaded into. You, you point it to the CSV file here. In this case, you're just going to need the basic one, which is the domains, the usernames, and the passwords. And it'll go right through each one of these domains. Say, in this case, it's going to download all the files into cb.com and then put them in a folder with that name. And it's going to go to do the dictionary legal and put them in a folder in that name. And it's going to download all those sites. You simply put your select your download directory. Uh, like I says, mine is the public HTML. Click the start task, and you're going to have mere copies of all your websites, 
on your personal PC. So if there's ever a server meltdown, you are covered. That's a quick overview of the FTP-O-Matic.